Hello, welcome back. Control. <sighs> Let's try that again. Good this afternoon, one. ladies and gentlemen, and welcome aboard the Eagle Limited bound for Chicago. Please have your tickets ready and enjoy okay, the so ride. Okay, so have your tickets ready. Next stops, Alton, Carlinville, and Springfield. That's Alton, Carlinville, and Springfield. Uh, tickets, please. Good evening, Taking all you fine-looking folks. Here's some smooth tunes to ease your minds and please your ears as we wait for that delicious dinner to roll right on in. Are we waiting for diner? Speaking night. Oh my god, fire! Fire! Something safe, so I guess that was right. Then I do it. What the fuck? I thought Please, I... Ma'am, do you have a ticket? No, I thought I did this sequence earlier. You had a pretty dark ride, huh? I'm pretty sure I did it. I'm replaying it now. I am pretty sure I did this in that order. Hmm, thank you. Well, we've done that. I think it might be over there. The last piece of darkness. Okay, let's hurry a bit. Because it is a long way. Okay, at least we know she won't drop it. And it's not here. <laughs> Wait, but I see a box over here. Oh, and I hope it be here. Thank you. Please, if you see darkness, shout. Hell. <laughs> Is it supposed to be all in here? Let's see, burn the dark. Yeah, in this part. Well, there's something to listen to. Hey, over here. Okay. Agent Guthrie, interrogation four C. Eagle Limited incident and its subsequent. Um, state alteration. Look, buddy, I have no clue what you're talking about. So you deny being a part of a radical group and to affect inanimate objects in a manner that would yield uh, um, unusual results? Yeah, I deny. But hey, tell me more about these results. They sound real unusual. I'm sure you recognize that the measures this group of yours takes to achieve their goals can be considered acts of terrorism. Goals? Measures? You're being very vague. Did you know you're being very vague? Alright, 62 dead. Passengers and crew, innocent people. Still sound vague to you? You might as well stop wasting both our time. I won't say anything and you can't say anything. I know you can't. Tell you what I can do. I can throw your sorry ass in one of our cozy containment cells. You can rock there until you're ready to talk. Or you could just save us both the trouble and tell me all about how you're going around creating altered items. How's that sound? Uh, did you really think we wouldn't catch on to you? We always do. Always. So you might as well come clean. For your sake. I, uh... <clears throat> I think I'll just talk to my lawyer instead. That's not how it works around here, buddy. But tell you what. Why don't I leave you here to think on it for a while? See you in a couple of days. Oh, wait, so wait, wait! This is the one that was left with our food. And all. Where the hell is this darkness? The darkness, oh. You know what, we'll check this place. Just be sure. 
But no, there's nothing over here. Why would there be anything in here? Let's check this whole place in the start. There's nothing over here. So we'll stick to the left side for now. Oh, it's over there! <sighs> I'm done. That should make him happy. You're that welcome. makes me happy. Okay, so let's change back to... Find a copy machine? Alright. Oh, um, this one. <laughs> we have so much, so many things to do. Is Jesse. Run. Thing, first things first. Unread. Unread. An alert from the blank WE monitoring station indicated minor blank activity occurring in the area. Agent Este Estevez was dispatched to investigate. Inside the blank lodge, she discovered the facility's former owner, Dr. Emil Hartman. He had been converted into a shaded individual and displayed violent behavior characteristic of its type. Agent Estevez alerted the on-site research team to the specimen's presence and, with some difficulty, it was successfully contained in a black frog cell. The cell and its inhabitant were transported safely back to HQ, where the specimen remains detained in the blank sector as the part of blank AWE investigation. Once the investigation is closed, research teams have petitioned to relocate this specimen to their sector for study. No, it's not really following us. Oh, well, that's good. Because I see this. Oh, it's going this way. He's going this way. It's very dark. <laughs> and I don't look like that. Wait, it's purple? I saw it, it's purple. I need to get rid of some again. I don't know, it's not here that Some over here. So we'll get rid of those. Nice. And it's infinite. Nice. Ooh, damage roll aiming. Yours. Nope. God damn it. I'm pressing the holding space. And I need to see these. Sorry. Okay. Hey, Stu. Did you hear about Fisher? Got himself in trouble in the motel. Why the hell does anyone volunteer to stake out that place? Gives me the creeps. But hey, at least he came back, if you can call it that. I saw some of the footage they pulled out of there with him. Thumb down in evidence processing showed me. Crazy stuff. Fisher had the cameras pointed at himself half the time. I'm guessing he went nuts on day one. He did catch something though, but one of those fiber optic cameras under the door of the room was hiding in and recorded something out in the hall. Looked like a shadow, maybe human. Tom tried to get the quality up, but it's still blurry as fuck. Just reaffirms my position. Stay the fuck out of motel. Anyway, up for up for some shoom later. At least I got up to an hour and 
38 minutes yesterday. New record to beat. Oh. I have a bad feeling about that. Where the hell are we? Okay. It's a little bit reassuring. Not much, but a tiny bit. And it, this doesn't shift it. We, this do, doesn't shift the ball. Anything new? Nope. Okay, I, I know it will remind me if there's anything new. I just have to check. I'm looking for light sources. We need to get those lights on. What the hell? Why is this close? Power core. I know. We need four power cores. No, stay out of the shadow. What the hell? You should have hit me. Okay, it's up there. Really? Wait, what? Where is it? Come here. This is gonna be tough. We need another power core. We need another three. And I don't like what they do when once we get them. Okay, we need to get to that one now. Oh, yes, we'll get there to here. Jump and just there it is. Oh, that was way too close. Wait, why I... Oh, it's like he decides which one we're gonna get. Give me a second. No, 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 Leave me alone, leave me alone. Come on, bring the battery in. Thank you. Where's the last one is over there? It doesn't seem to be... Look, I tried to save. <laughs> Thank you for dying, I actually needed that. <laughs> oh my god, this is so horrifying. Why does it always happen? It always happens to me. Get out of there.
Thanks, my idea. <laughs> I have no idea where we're going. Here! It's right here. Oh, come on! Stop finding new ways to elude me. Really? Here before totally on purpose. Let's see anything else to pick up? I don't think so. Yeah, let's go into the unknown, I guess. Don't scare me. Oh, return to uh, active investigations. Okay. Oh. Uh, well, I think this is faster way to get back. Wait, where's active invest? Yeah, it's definitely faster way. To get back. So we can go like this. And we are already in the active investigations. When was I supposed to go back here? Exactly. Is his containment cell somewhere in here? Wait, we will we s Oh right, we have the last piece up up in the north. Right, right. I didn't forget. But yes. God, he was hideous. He tore the security door into the Bright Falls AWE site wide open. He was so ugly, like wow, I got a good look at him and Christ! He does not look like he used to. The hiss must have messed him up for something. He, he, he looks like a, a bar rag that's been twisted by the world's strongest man. Or a monster from some 80s horror movie. You know, back when it was all practical effects? Ugh! Nasty! Real Did you say something? Nasty. Remember, I can't hear you. Never mind, just go after Hartman. Ugh, oh, so disgusting. Whoa, that was quick! I thought he was going... We go on and on about Hartman. I've written, rewritten. The darkness wants to hide the past and make me lose my way. I trust what I read on these pages. I wrote them for a reason. Cut through the reality, tear it apart, and rewrite it. They are drawn to the mystery. Okay, and what did you mean exactly? Uh, yeah. I've written and rewritten, deconstructed, reconstructed, experimented with different voices, changed the style, changed myself, forgotten the language, relearned the language. Have I been here before? Gone down this path before? The darkness wants to hide the past to make me lose my way. You must know where you've been to know where you're going. I trust what I read on these pages. I wrote them for a reason. My notes to myself. The only way to make progress, recap, then write more. The style then, lose the fat, make it clear, ugly, functional, present, be blunt, only the brutal truth, cut through the reality, tear it apart, rewrite it. Be clever, make them do the work, form the image in their minds, they make it, you just imply, incept. They're drawn to the mystery, obsessed. You set it up, 
they put it together, their interpretation, and there's only one because you give them no choice. And they believe in it because it's theirs now. I have to say, I always admire when in video games, oh, I have to train uh, they use both actors, gas scenes, and models. I always preferred like acting scenes over fully rendered gas scenes. Stuck. Unstuck? Or maybe there's more. Oh, it's up there as well. Oh, no, it's down there. What the fuck? And I, I hate you and I hate your corpse. Now, where is mine life? Yes. That's nowhere up there. It was just some maintain work to do. Maintaining work? It was maintaining. Like, don't scare someone like that. Okay, there's lots of Thank you for nothing. meeting with us again, Dr. Arman. It's my pleasure, gentlemen. I hope the information I provided thus far has been of some small use. It's been invaluable, Doctor. Really, we have a much clearer picture of this event, thanks to your accounts. Well, I. You consider myself a keen observer of... We did have one question, though. You mentioned in an earlier conversation that your patients displayed, and I'm paraphrasing here, unnatural abilities that you, in fact, encouraged during their time in your lodge. It'd be very helpful if you could fill us in on the details there. Of course. Like yourselves, I work to understand and even bend the rules of our earthly paradigm. My patient's well-being was paramount, of course, but... I would hardly be a man of science if I did not reach out at the underlying truth. As I stated in my written proposal, I believe working alongside your organization could be greatly beneficial to both parties. Sharing notes, as they say. Thank you, Doctor. That's all we need to hear. Remy? Dr. Emil Hartman, you have been found in breach of codes 4, 8, and 74 of the Federal Bureau of Control Criminal Offense System. What? You can't do this? I am a well-connected man. You're making a dire mistake, my friend. You will be detained until further notice and all personal property will be confiscated, including the Cauldron Lake Lodge. That's preposterous. You can't just seize my property. I'm a United States citizen. I have rights. That lodge is my life's work. I'm offering you years of research. Get him out of here. You're making a mistake. You have to listen to me. You have to listen. Thank you for no. meeting with us again. Oh, God damn it. Stop it. No, I'm not listening to you. La, 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 la. We want it? No, we need three. Oh, it's for civil levitating. That's why I didn't. It's been invaluable, Doctor. Okay. We have a much clearer picture of this. Oh, of course. Of course, it's through the motel. Maybe even inside the motel. Well. I've forgotten again. I had a plan. I know it. I forgot.
What? We can just... Whatever is going on with Wake, he clearly needs some help. Yeah... So do I. Next one, please. Do it leave something behind? No, we just need to turn on the lights. My foot no room open. Going in bad. Wake had to escape, right? His escape. Wake needed a hero. A hero needed a crisis. No, 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 I don't need a crisis. About the government agency, Wake needed something oh. special, something to convey an alien force mimicking human intelligence. Polaris? You know, that's interesting. The story needed many beginnings, many springs, streams that turned into a river, a flood, and then an ocean. This was one. Wake used the materials he had, the connections he had, the people, the places. Wake put them in to make it true. His wife, the psychiatrist, his city. These connections, like magnets, move things. Alice was a conduit. She'd been in the dark place. The thing that had been Hartman sensed her near, sensed Wake through her. Went berserk. Broke loose. Wake made sure Alice was already gone by then. Safe. The more springs, the more the story became real. The more people believed. Cause and effect. It was extremely delicate and hard work. It had to go through the path of least resistance where success was most likely. Where there was a connection already. Wake felt the pressure grow in his head. Going mad. Wake had to escape. Right. His. Escape. He was already out. He wanted to make it true. Wake needed a hero. A hero needed a crisis. For the part in the story about the government agency, Wake needed something special. Something to convey an alien force mimicking human intelligence. Something that can't be translated. Translated. Wake channeled Burroughs and Bowie. He cut up sentences and words. Orange peel. You are home. Insane. Yes! He put them in a shoebox. He pulled out the words. Wake created a Dada's poem. He'd try anything once. Or had he tried this before? It sounds like this. Like the H I S S. I don't want to go in there. Okay. Another replica, like the one they made for ordinary. What happened here? Is that the power switch? Send a ranger to my location. I don't want that camp to go. God damn it, you scared the hell out of me. What's that? After reaching out to the bureau, Alice Wake was brought into the oldest house for an interview on blank 2017. See file blank for the full transcript. 
The interview conducted by agents Shah and Dempsey revealed that Mrs. Wake has had recurring nightly visitations from her missing ex-husband in her New York apartment. Address blank Mr. Wake. Appears out of nowhere and rushes at her down the corridor. According to her impression, he appears crazy and horrifying, clearly coming at her with violent intent. Miss Wake believes that he is haunting her, insisting he is not Alan but a fucking monster in his body. Miss Wake has not been sleeping out of the fear of these visits. visits. Her attempts to keep the lights on through the night result in the relevant hallways light bulb breaking every night, possibly indicating involvement of the blank. Further investigation required, we propose installing monitoring equipment in the apartment. Copies of supplies requests from L5014 have been sent to Mr. Kinkland and administration for appro approval. Okay. Oh, I thought his health was draining. Okay. We're safe. Kinda. I saw I see one over two over there. I thought I saw two. He is hardcore. An unconfirmed threshold manifestation occurred at Coldron Lake WA. The citizens of Bright Falls had gathered in the town's southwestern fields for the annual festival known as Deerfest. Eyewitnesses all claimed that the day had been sunny, confirmed by reviews of the area's weather reports, but then, with no warning, a thunderstorm appeared in the direction of the Anderson farm and a tornado rose from Coldron Lake. The torrential rain that followed caused a flash flood. flood. It was as if the day had turned into night, testimony from Blank. Frank Bricker, the sheriff of Bright Falls, formerly a bureau agent, see employee file Blank, managed to guide the crowd to safety as the festival grounds were destroyed by the flood. The festival was cancelled, ending one day early. Lack of official bureau presence on the scene makes this even difficult to report as a confirmed AWE, Though the similarity to other known events in the Bright Falls area lend credence to the accounts of the towns. So, towns people. What is he shooting at? Just shoot at him! Stop it. Don't touch my age, my ranger. Where is he? Oh no! No way in hell. Oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck. I just no. Where's the No, we don't we we'll lock another one over there. Where's he? Nope! 
think I missed them all. Problem anymore, Langston. But investigations need someone to run it. Interested? I've seen what happens to sector heads, ma'am. No, thank you. Ma'am, I'm getting something on my terminal here an AWE alert from Bright Falls, Washington. But it might be a glitch. The date's all wrong a couple of years in the future. And we're in lockdown. There shouldn't be any incoming signals. Maybe it was active before we went into lockdown? Are there agents on site? Let me check. Agent Estevez is the field agent in charge of monitoring the site, so she should be there to let us know if the situation has been through any major changes recently. Creeping down my spine. Ugh. Hey, but search for the projector. Yeah, we're back on the main track. But first things first, we're gonna look for the head. So for now, this is gonna be it. Thank you very much. Stay alive and see you soon. Bye.